In this video, I will try to show you how to use submodule in Pascal. So why do you need submodule? Because look here I have a system and it looks so messy that um, you can't find anything easily and so to overcome this problem we can use submodule. So what we can get this from view we have to go component wizard and then we need to give any name for example surface pressure so we want to move this part uh, inside the submodule and how many signals do you need look here I need one trip signal to send a trip signal in this uh, logical circuit and an output this Q1 so I need one input input and one output ports and then add ports and then module don't forget to check this and let's name this it will be trip q1 and the output could be q1 and it would be the output port and data type would be integer so let's finish so we then we can just copy this full system here so I will here is the input signal and here is the output signal So let's run our system. So look, everything is working perfectly, and now my uh, diagram is not so messy like before. And if we, if anyone wants to change the graphics, so we can go there graphics, and then let's move it a little bit left. So look, it looks. So perfect. So in this way we can use uh, sub module. So that's for all today.